Who are you voting for in 2024, Trump or Kamala Harris? Uh, Kamala Harris. Why? Because she just seems like the better candidate. I like the things that she stands for. And she's also not racist, um, sexist. Anything specifically you like that she stands for? She stands for like women's rights, anti-gun policies. She supports um, LGBTQ issues. Why would you not vote for Trump in 2024? At Project 2025, it's been an ongoing discussion, especially within the Republican Party. Just Trump's morals as a person. I don't feel like Trump is a president. I feel like he's a businessman that wants to be president to make things better for the upper class when that's not the reality of most people living in the United States. Who are you voting for in 2024, Trump or Kamala Harris? Kamala Harris. Why? Because she's the girl, like what else can I say? Why not Trump? Like his plans aren't really seeming all that good. At least Kamala got like that experience with like the people. She's been here, she seems nice. What do you have to say to all the blacks for Trump? I hope that you guys can see the light one day. That man is not for us. He's not for black and brown people, so. Who are you voting for in 2024, Trump or Kamala Harris? We'll be voting for Kamala Harris. And why is that? Like for history, for there to be like the first woman or like the first black woman. And I feel like I'd rather move down that path, which is a little bit slightly less evil than like the Trump path, definitely. Trump, he's, he's not a great leader. He's very selfish and he does things for his own personal gain and I feel like he's only doing things that benefit the rich and not everyone as a whole. What do you have to say to all the blacks for Trump? It just doesn't make sense to me because I do think he is racist so it's like you're kind of like hurting yourself at that point. And any specific plans that you don't like that Trump has planned? That whole entire thing that people have been putting around, if you read through all of that stuff, it's not, it's not given for the people, it's given for certain types of people. Why would you not vote for Trump in 2024? When he was the president in 2020, a lot of the things that I feel like I was fighting for, it seemed like he was fighting against. Like what? Such as like the Black Lives Matter movement, him being so adamant on like trying to make it to stop, or definitely him like still having some setbacks on Obamacare and things like that. I feel like a lot of people just don't feel comfortable with his presidency. And of course, with um, the 2025 plan, it's very like suppressive for a lot of minorities right now. Kamala Harris has more values that are aligned with definitely all the abortion rights and just reproductive rights in general. I feel like as a whole, society should have never touched those rights. And I really appreciate everything that she stands for. Also, Trump's Project 2025. He claims he has nothing to do with that, but I feel like we all know that that's not true. What do you have to say to all the blacks for Trump? Just think over your decision and really look at the facts. You can't just go off of one thing that he did during his presidency. You have to see the full scope of it. Trump is not for us. So the fact that we are supporting him as a people, I don't agree with it. But to each their own, I'm not here to judge anyone else. The stimulus check was, we were supposed to get that anyway. Go home. But good luck. How can Trump win your vote? If he just does better for the people, if he speaks more kindly and comes out to see us, that would be nice.